still guy again. I just really love the fact that I was able to approach these guys. They were just chilling around and I I approached them and I say guys look I I have something that can keep us busy tomorrow. Uh, if you are interested we can help each other. They were curious. I'm really happy that I'm able to share this you know this bread with you guys. If we had to stay home we wouldn't have the bread. And I appreciate you, you are hard workers. Many people will have turned down this whole thing and just say, hey, hey that thing, I can't do it. Where does Zulu come from now? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I think sharing is good, you know, because they do have family that look up to them I was like you could be able to buy bread but if you don't come it means you're just gonna be around and with no money no bread so they wanted to know how much I say why don't we go and take a look at it and then we agree on it from there they said no I think we can't do it now oh, let's go tomorrow and all the tools as well maybe if we agree then we can just start i said okay cool it's no problem of which we did we came and it didn't give us issues they just agreed and said ah oh, let's let's do this let's do this man it looked like it was really tough to do you know that's why i always say like you will never know the powers you have until you have started so in the beginning it looked like it's it's just near a machine or something but when you start you make a meter or two and then you realize the road is clear i mean we can go on and finish we didn't think we could be able to finish today but just in four hours we're done and that's how beautiful it is and we just appreciate the fact that we can be able to do these things i need to take care of these cones you see from the last time they are growing now they are getting big and big every day so nice so beautiful but for me to make sure they grow properly i'm just trying to move the wheat around them Just so much of them here in a way that you can't imagine. Again, until you have studied it, you will realize that it is just possible. So, with that being said, I want to challenge you if you are an African guy. I want to challenge you. You don't have to say you can't do this because you have uh, your ways of being. You have, you can afford yourself, you can buy food. But deep down there, you know that someone in your family is starving. That's just a reality, guys. And why are they starving? By lack of knowledge and lacking someone to encourage them doing something. Just start. If you have your money, then they realize that you are doing this. Probably they will realize something is wrong with them and they will start. They will definitely start so there is no reason why you should close your hands and say no i'm fine because you're not inspiring anyone how is you being fine inspiring someone somewhere in africa i mean let's just start this guys i'm challenging you to start something and 
not you don't have to show it on TV you don't have to send me videos but just do it and show your families that you're doing it it is really great it is gonna help a lot of people your generation people in your family and maybe just not your family and other people that will look that knows you or that will come in contact with you and see what you're doing regardless of what you have and they will be inspired so my part I'm playing it I can assure you that I've inspired plenty of people my family are number one they are so proud of me they can't believe I'm doing this they keep on asking me why 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 is it you want money I think no I just want to learn to do something so I've just realized there's another challenge here guys the monkeys plenty of monkeys here I've just chased one and but it managed to run away with the the cone the whole of it just got really so quick you know it's like this is the actual moment when they come here it came so fast from this bush here from here and then removed one big cone here and I was that side I saw it by the moment when I ran it was already gone can you imagine guys look at this one probably it's tried to check whether there's something here and it realizes it's still too small it got away and came to this one here the one that was here was very big as you can see they normally two you can see there's this one remaining there was another big one here just like there as well there's two yeah so it came here and then pulled one and ran through this bush here sometimes they, they, they cut the whole trunk of a of a a corn like from down here they just cut it you know, of course, when they come here and they see there's no one, they just really settle and stay to enjoy. It is not easy. It is a challenge. But what can we do? I don't know. Hey, anything, anything you can advise us against the monkeys, please welcome. Tell us. Tell me if there is anything you think I can do to get rid of these monkeys because they seem to be very aggressive and taking all my cones. So I've been visiting around and I can say there are some good cones somewhere. yeah so that is guys um still here i'll show you the end result but so far we have done a big piece all this area was covered in a bush i've decided that i should also be removing the chilies because they, they tired they, they got so red they, falling and all this. I think it is the good way to just remove them. So one thing came to my mind. I'm like, we always wonder how people are living with the fact that they're being called poor, they're being cold and lazy and stuff. But I think everyone has got a role to play in this whole thing. If we really need to get rid of our situation, it just means everyone needs to contribute. I mean, there's plenty of guys in cities and big companies who are working and making a lot of money. I mean, a lot of money. But what they do with the money is something you need to ask yourself. So we, we, we are being labeled as the people who like life the most. I mean, black people, if you give him millions, they will just look at a million car and stuff 
in a month or two that thing is scrapped and the whole money is gone but my question is why don't you take a few thousands and invest in something that will assist the other person to make you know at least bread on the table or they just food on the table is that too difficult to ask People are just sitting on money, man. Let people create something that will give other people opportunities. I mean, just create opportunities, if I might say so. Share whatever you have with other people. Of course, not for free. Just create something that will make them work. Black people want to work, but there are no jobs. And the rich people who are black and not doing anything about it. They're just sitting on the money, working in these big companies and whatever, month end they get paid and go to expensive stuff and chow all that money is gone. Just in two seconds. <sighs> That's a story for another day. Let me just get out of here. Let me go meet my guys. We are done, we about to go. It is productive. For those who have been watching my videos since I started, thank you very much for uh, my perseverance. You guys can see that it's paying off. I mean, look at these whole things. So beautiful. So nice. Just looking at them is really making me speechless. I almost don't know what to say but again i will just say to you guys that are i love this and i'm really happy we are gonna go now my guys are waiting for me that side these are those pipes guys if you watch my video from the very start you must have seen this pipe from the installations and all that, the drip lines are still there. Oh my God, it's crazy! Dozy, yeah, Soro boys, tuko pamoja, home boys tunakuja. Narafiki muka kunya pia Hukusita kusemo na nipenda pia Ukanifanya ni wapizi na mapenzi pia Vue linyesha nka kumbatia Nika kufanya siku mojo sije nijutia Baridi giza lika ingia Nika vua koti langu nika kupatia Nika shika mikono na pega pia Nika kufusha taratibu kuna kuimbia My life, my news, my loose control If this is your first time, I almost forgot If this is your first time, please do subscribe on this channel because if you don't you're missing out a lot of fun stuff great stuff i go to cities i go to malls i go to towns to villages to everything that you might think is exciting everything that excites me at least comes here on this screen in this channel so don't miss out subscribe and share with your friends if you do like this video please give it a thumbs up and yeah man you know what to do just share it trust someone inspire someone else show them ah you want where oh Nikashika mikono na pega pia Nika kufusha taratibu kuna kuimbia My life, my news, my news Chundundirima, chundundirima Chundundirima, chundundirima So you see how far is this? Where you want my love, my love Um, chundundirima is not far from that far Just about 30 meters My love, my love Where you want my love, my love You can't drink this water, but I'm saying I will drink it like that. It looks clean, plus it's running. I mean, 
It's no choice here.